in support of one of their own. A firefighter's young son was recently diagnosed with a rare form of leukemia. So the men are stepping up and banding together to raise money and awareness. Six on your side's Michael Severn reports. This group of firefighters say they are all part of one big family, and when one of them is in need, they're always willing to help. Max right now is uh, currently battling uh, what we're all fighting for. Mighty Max Jones may be one of the youngest members of this family. The eight-year-old son of a Boise firefighter was diagnosed with leukemia the day before Christmas Eve. When this got brought up to me that they wanted to do something for Max, it started out as, hey, we want to do a workout. And from there, as firefighters do, it just snowballed. Three, two, one, go! And working out they did, doing CrossFit to conquer and find a cure. Teams of first responders made their muscles burn all to help raise money. And while some were shedding pounds, oh yeah, I feel so good. Firefighters from Nampa and Boise shaved their heads, all for Mighty Max. Max is awesome. He's Mighty Max. He's gonna do good, and, and we're here to support him. It's all for my buddy Max. I, I don't have any hair anymore. But those now bald firefighters aren't done yet. Soon they'll be headed to Seattle to climb the stairs of the second tallest building west of the Mississippi, all to raise money for the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. We have all these people out here supporting us today and, and getting behind him and helping us raise money and more importantly raise awareness of what's going on and seeing what we can do to help not just Max but other people in our community that are struggling from this disease. Michael Severin, 6 on your side.